and guest rooms are guest suites of hotels and motels and sleeping rooms and dormitories at least blank general purpose receptacles installed in the rooms is or required to be readily accessible one two three all what we'll do is we'll just go straight to the index and we're going to be looking up guest rooms it's going to be the easiest way to find this uh guest rooms are kind of a little niche category and so we'll just check it out so g guest rooms and then it says tamper resistant receptacles we're not looking at that we're looking at outlets technically receptacles and light fixtures are all outlets and so we'll go to 210.60 210.60 210 first tab there and then we'll go to dot 60 right here 210.60 is guest room guest suites dormitories so general uh, we got receptacle placement so that's probably going to get us closer. It says the total number of receptacle outlets shall not be less than required in 21052A. We can take a look at that in a second if we need to. These receptacle outlets shall be permitted to be located conveniently for permanent fixture, or furniture layout. At least two receptacle outlets shall be readily accessible. Well, there you go. So the answer is... This one was a pretty straightforward and easy question. Uh, not too hard to find the answer. I uh, just want to take a little tangent here and say thank you very much for all of you for viewing this channel. It's recently blown up. I've got a ton of new subscribers. If you're a new viewer, please consider subscribing. This channel still unmonetized, so I don't get any money from this. Um, I'm really doing this for the benefit of everyone out there trying to pass their, their journeyman's license. I really truly believe in lifting this industry as a whole and how we do that is getting more people licensed and more people uh, out there who are able to interpret the code and do more professional work. So I believe in the mission and again I want to thank you for watching these videos it means a lot